And then I really like to focus on gratitude and, and everyone, I mean, so many people talk gratitude is like everywhere these days. And, you know, you know, you have to say it in the present tense. I'm so grateful for this beautiful day. I'm so grateful for my friends and family, but, but it's more than that. So I want to make two additional points to really push your reader, put your, push your listeners or watchers on gratitude. First of all, of course, you say it in present tense, like you've already achieved what it is you want. And then you tie it into an emotion so that you have that emotional connection with the feeling of gratitude. So like, I'm so grateful that my children are home and we have this great holiday because I love spending time with them. And it, they, I feel so good when I'm with my kids so that you can really feel that connection. So it really enters you on an emotional level. So that's the first thing, adding the because statement, the emotional aspect besides the I am. And then here's the big, here's the big kicker with gratitude. You can be grateful for something that hasn't happened yet. And actually, this is the gratitude that you really want to harness. So say your goal is, you know, to have a better relationship with your husband. And so you think, okay. I'm so grateful that my husband and I are connecting on this deep level because now we really have this soul connection and it's something that I've yearned for my whole life. And and maybe you haven't haven't achieved that level yet but you're being you're thankful for it so that then your mind doesn't because what happens is you get this these um this fear comes in because you're exiting your comfort zone and you're entering into this unknown zone and your 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 mind is trying to keep you safe. That internal critic is trying to keep you safe. And so whenever you go into the, an unknown zone, it's going to act up and say, no, that's never going to happen, blah, blah, blah. But the thing is, if you take what you want in the future and bring it into the present, then your mind is comfortable with it. So it doesn't have that scary element. So when it gets close to you, it says, oh yeah, we've been talking about this for a long time. This is like no big deal. Yeah. 